Hi everyone, happy Thursday, thank you for tuning in and welcome to your third civilization of Mesoamerica. We are now finally talking about personally my favorite Mesoamerican ancient civilization and that's the Inca. Now the reason why I think I'm a big fan of the Inca is because they created one of the big wonders of the world and that's what you see here in this image. Now some of you might know this off the bat and if you don't that's okay. I'm here to tell you this is Machu Picchu. It's a very very ancient and sacred part of, uh, mess of Incan uh, civilization, of the Incan Empire. Now what you're going to do today is you are going to dive in and be introduced to who the Inca were. Now the way you're going to do that is on Google Classroom for today, you will have access to a YouTube video that is a TED Talk video about the Inca. After you watch this video, you have a few questions you need to answer on the Google Forms. Go ahead and do that and you're done. Now before you get into that, I just want to go over a few things. Now, the Inca controlled their empire in a region within the Andes mountain region in South America. Now, what you see here that's shadowed, that's essentially where the Inca civilization spread out to. Now, yes, it's in a mountain range, and that mountain range is within the Andes mountains. But some things I want you to think about are what are the benefits, what are the pros and cons of being in a mountainous region like this one? Now, you might be thinking, one, you're right by the coast. That means you have access to water, you have access to food like fish. It's very good. Some of you might be thinking, well, if it's a mountain, that means there must be a lot of trees. And if there's a lot of trees, there might be a lot more vegetation, a lot more plants, a lot more crops. The, the main thing here is there's a lot of resources. And that really did benefit the Inca civilization. Now, that's all for today. As you notice, I'm sitting outside. I'm trying to be outside as much as I can, and I hope you are too. But... That's the end of this video. I know it's very short and sweet, but if you have any questions, please let me know. I hope you enjoy that video the way I do. And if you have any questions, again, please let me know. I miss you guys. And the countdown to the last day of school is officially starting. This is your last, second to last official lesson because next week we have something really cool planned for you. Now that's all for today. I miss you guys. I love you guys. Until next time, see you soon.